Lord, you are an awesome God. You are so wonderful, and we thank you for this particular spot on the earth that you've placed us. We thank you that you brought um, all the Pan American athletes together to this location to race, and Lord, we just ask that uh, you would keep them safe and take care of them. Lord, we just ask that this entire race will glorify you and that you will be recognized throughout the world of who you are. You have created the water, you have created the earth, you've created the sky, and you've created each and every individual on this world, Lord. And we thank you for that. I just pray that um, we could just glorify you in all that we do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, for TriCal TV, this is Eric Gilston. We're just moments away, about 20 seconds away from our elite race here today. A world-class field once again assembled here at San Francisco Triathlon at Treasure Island. All right, they're underway. So we got Simon Whitfield, number one here today. Kevin Collington in there. James Elvery. Russell Andrew. Matthew Seymour. Stephen Sexton. Victor Plata, just to mention a few, the great Scott Young in there. So we've got two laps on the swim, six laps on the bike, and then three laps on the run. International Olympic distance, that's 1.5 kilometer swim, 40 kilometer bike, 10 kilometer run. In mileage, that's 0.93 miles of swim, so just under a mile swimming. That's 24.8 miles biking and 6.2 miles running. There you see the buoy actually moving, the triangle inflatable orange buoy moving around. These athletes are flailing in there, so a lot can happen around that. So the pace line has spread out a bit. We've got a couple of athletes up front and then about the majority of the athletes in a chase group number one. All right, these athletes finishing up their first of two laps around Clipper Cove here at the friendly confines of Treasure Island. So we have three athletes leading the swim. There is a good 10, maybe 20 yard gap in between them and the majority of the rest of our men's elite field. All right, so what we're going to see here is we're going to get about 20 athletes around that buoy in the next 10 seconds. Now, that's going to be a violent corner right there. So things have smoothed out a little bit. That first buoy, a little bit more physical. Still, though, you can see it right there. Athletes having to stop just for a second to get around that buoy. Throws the rhythm off. Now they'll get back into a rhythm. We'll see a pace line stretch out for that second loop. All right, this is our first swimmer in today's elite race. 18 minutes and one seconds, it looks like. Number 29 here today, Dustin McClarty, Boulder, Colorado. Andrew McCartney, second out of the water. Second out of the water, Andrew McCartney. Number 41, Kyle Leto. All right, Dustin McClarty maintaining his lead in T1, heading out on the bike. Right now, Simon Whitfield in front, Leto and McCartney. All right, they are strung out now, the Peloton. So we have McCartney, Leto, and Whitfield. Whitfield, McCartney, and Leto in the men's race.
All right, the pace line stretching out in the men's race. All right, so in the final lap, we've got a two-pack leading out Simon Whitfield and number 41, Kyle Leto. All right, so lightning fast transitions are part of this ITU draft legal triathlon. Kyle Leto, a local from Walnut Creek, leading out 2000 Olympic gold medalist Simon Whitfield from Canada. Whitfield can run like the wind. He can hang glide on a Dorito. Simon Whitfield leading out Kyle Leto. If Kyle Leto can just hold on and take a bungee cord and hold on to Whitfield, but you can already see Whitfield gapping on this 10 yards right now, soon 15. All right, he's a young man from Canada, number eight, Andrew McCartney, great swimmer. So the pack is coming in. Becker, Collington, McClarty, Billington, Brandon, Sexton in the house. All right, so Quintana right in front of Whitfield, but Quintana, he's only on his second loop. Right now, Simon's starting his third loop, Adam Truax on his second loop. So although they're running together, Whitfield one lap ahead of those other two athletes. So Collington, known for his running, a 2007 National Collegiate Champion for your University of Florida Fighting Gators, Kevin Collington, he might run down Leto. From Victoria, British Columbia, Simon Whitfield. All right, so in 2000, in Sydney, the Olympics had their first triathlon. Simon Whitfield from Canada won the gold medal at that time. So Simon, pretty exciting uh, period in your life right now. You're a 2000 gold medalist, you're a 2008 silver medalist in the Olympics, and now you're coming off a pretty big win in Ivy. How are you feeling today? No, that was fun, that was great. This is, uh, who doesn't love coming to San Francisco, eh? It's terrific. So how about that prize purse out there at Hyvee? And uh, let's just talk about a little bit of that finish there. I mean, that gentleman from Australia, Brad, I mean, good, good, my, my, that was something. I think he thought he was on the giant sliding for, for, for home there or something. <laughs> no, it was, uh, it was great, exciting, but um, no, it was fun today. The, the young American guy, uh, Kyle Leto, did a great job, and uh, it was fun to be out the front there. It's a great atmosphere here. So what do you think? What's next for you? Uh, off to Hamburg, off to Germany, and uh, well, back home tonight to my daughter, but other than that. <laughs> All right, congratulations. Another fantastic race, and here we go. Looks like we've got an American coming in, holding on for third. Let's see if we can bring him in. All right, in third place from University of Florida, fighting Gator, Kevin Collington, third place. Great job. So Whitfield, McCartney, Collington, one, two, three, and from New Zealand, James Elvery, fourth place. Kyle Leto from Walnut Creek in fifth place. Our top five, Simon Whitfield in second place, Andrew McCartney, Kevin Collington, number three today, James Elvery in fourth place, and in fifth place from Walnut Creek, Kyle Leto, our top five today, 2009 San Francisco Triathlon at Treasure Island.